Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Play Pokemon Emerald version. This will be my very first Pokemon Let's Play in terms of the RPG titles. Uh, let's just go ahead and do a new game. Yes, this is a LP I decided to do right along Skyward Sword mostly because I think my LP status has kind of gotten a little bit rusty and I think this is a game that I really need to do to help me get out of this rust I'm in and back to where I originally was and with and why not with one of my favorite Pokemon games uh, so yeah the basis of Pokemon you catch them you trade them you battle with them something that I'm pretty sure just about everyone knows about Pokemon and I am a boy of course Alright, my name. Alright, you know what? Just because I can, I'm going to name my character one of my favorite. Uh, call me a weeb of you if. Since I'm decided to do this, I am naming one of my favorite. I am naming him after one of my favorite anime characters. Alright. Yes, our name is Vash. Yes, we are moving to Little Root. And then we shrink a uh, to a very small sprite. Okay, let's go ahead and hop out and just see our new house. Why would we be riding in the back of a truck anyway? I mean, that that'd be really really dangerous to do. Also, that must be a pretty good sized truck for it to be an off-road truck and then able to get here without any roads. The movie's Pokemon's doing all the work. Well, why don't you help? Alright, so basically now we can go ahead and just kind of explore this new house. It's a bigger off. We'll get into more of them later. And then here's our room, of course. We have a TV. I might like this program. Better get going. And right here we have a GameCube. That's actually what I'm recording this on. Is a uh, is the Game Boy Advance. Uh, I mean, the Game Boy player for the GameCube. Uh, I don't know if there's anything on my PC. Let me draw. Hey, there's a potion. Might as well take it. I actually think they stopped doing that one Pokemon game. I don't know. Alright, so what time is it? I'm looking off my PC clock when I'm recording this. Alright, let's see. Du -du -du. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. That's way too soon. No, it's not that. It is about... Du -du 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 -du. About 11.45. No, that's right. I'm actually recording this on a weekend. <laughs> Make sure everything's here, I guess. Actually, oh, hold on. Oh, fast, fast, come quickly. Okay, anyway, we just brought you this report in front of Petalburg Gym. <laughs> Professor Birch. Huh. 
change that R to a T, and that's a bad word. Anyway, actually, I think this right here is a map. I actually forgot to see. The Hoenn region map. Oh, this right here is Hoenn. I actually think this is based off somewhere in Asia. I can't remember, though, because I think all Pokemon locations are based off islands from Asia or somewhere else in the world. I don't know. And if not, I'm just stating something that's not real, so... Ignore me. Alright, so here's a little route. We'll go in here. Let's see. That's just the thing about Pokemon that I love. You can barge into people's houses and I don't care. Our new next door neighbor. Hi! Well, I'd say if she's really the only female in this entire town. Hey, there's an item. Let's get it. What? Also, this is something else I'm going to give to uh, Pokemon Emerald, I or the third gen in general, is that I really do think uh, third gen has the best soundtrack out of all Pokemon games. I mean, you can disagree with me if you want to, but I mean, there's just so many themes I can really listen to and have a good time with, like May's theme right there. Also, she has an orange gay cube. GameCube, sorry. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Yeah. Let's see if we can go out into the exploring. Um, hi, there's a scary Pokemon outside. I hear it cries that. Uh, I want to go see, but I don't have any Pokemon. Can you go see what's happening for me? Yes! <laughs> He's getting chased by a Zigzagoon. My bag, there's a Pokeball. Alright, so now we have the choice of our three starters. You always have this in each Pokemon game, as you should know. There's the Grass Pokemon Trico, who I never pick. Torchic, who I do regularly pick, and Mudkip, which spawned a thousand memes. I could just do whichever one of these, because I am more of the Torchic guy than I am uh, Mudkip. Really, I'm talking about their uh, final e um, evolve forms. For I think Mudkip is more or less the easy mode, because I never really have a hard time with trainers when I pick him. Uh, Torchic, on the other hand, is a little bit more medium, and Trico is more or less the hard mode. So really, this is something else that people don't know about Pokemon, is that really that your three stars can be the easy, normal, or hard mode. And since I'm going to go for a little bit more of what I originally do, I'm probably just going to go ahead and pick Torchic. And a level 2 Zigzagoon Wild. And I have a male Torchic. So just to kind of get into the uh, base of the Pokemon battling, you have uh, your four commands here. We can't run away because we have to protect the guy here. You have your back here where we can use a potion that I picked up earlier, but we can't really do anything. And, you know, here's our key items. Items, Pokeballs, stuff. Again, I'll get into more of this later. Uh, Pokemon, which we only have Torchic for right now. I can actually see a summary and stuff. Has a calm nature. Uh, and it likes all of the stats and next level boost, scratch, growl, and blah blah blah. Alright, so now I'm done talking about all that stuff. Let's fight. And these are our moves. We have growl, which will lose their attack, but since we're only fighting level 2, I'm gonna go for the more offensive approach. Using scratch. And also, I wanna say this now that I'm probably one of the. I'm probably gonna be a very unique Pokemon battler guy that you've never really seen battle this way before, because I am. Very different than a lot of people um, Pokemon battle because I've never done competitive battling. I don't go into the whole looking up what all the special abilities do and all that stuff. I really just catch Pokemon I like and train them up. Woo. Are right, you studying Pokemon Tall Grass? So it's not really that tall. I mean, when you stand in it, you can see your head and everything. Father. And my father's blood. Well, yeah, I'm his son. And we got our first Pokemon, Torchic. Why not give it a nickname? Yeah, now you can either leave it as Torchic, but I'm going to name him something, but I'm trying to decide what I can do. I, I can think of two ways I want to do this. I can name him after one of my favorite anime characters again, but I don't want to be that stupid. I kind of want to name him... After some of my fa after some of my friends off of YouTube, but then I think that would be doing uh, favoritism. Uh, hmm. 
know what? I think I will just name it. I name my characters after some of my, uh... No, no, wait. Why am I not naming him this? This will be perfect for when he, uh, becomes a, uh... His final evolve form. Actually, hold on. I do this. Uh... Norse. Why not? It fucking works. <laughs> uh, do you think it'd be a good idea to see May? Yeah, sure. Yeah, so now we gotta go meet May. Okay. So now we have our first Pokemon, and I've kind of gone into the whole thing of Pokemon battling, and I've only gotten to the first ten minutes. Well, that's pretty good. Uh, actually, I think we talked to this guy, we'll get something. And again, we get into our Pokemon stuff. Now, something I'm going to say right now is that I will be editing out a lot of the Pokemon encounters, unless it's something that we've seen before. Uh, I'm going to just edit it out, which is Puchiana. Um, I don't really understand, I don't know if he's a good Pokemon or not. I like his design in terms of my Tiana. And unless you're looking for a dark type this early in the game, don't worry about it. And I'm not going to put him on the team, because really, I'm going to be making this up as I go, because I don't even know what I'm going to end up with. We don't have any Pokeballs yet, so we can't really do anything. Okay, I think we talked to this guy, we get something. Alright, never mind. See, I mean, also, there's something I want to bring up about the truck. We'd have, He'd have to drive around all this grass here. And here's our Wurmple, which is pretty much a Caterpie of the game. This is something else I like about Pokemon, is that I can play this game with one hand. <laughs> it gives me time just to kind of, you know, put my hand behind my head, just sit back and relax, and just press A and move the control stick when I need to. It's another reason, I guess, I kind of want to LP this game, it's just because... I don't know, I think it's time I actually did something like this, and also, this is kind of a prototype project to my net. Hopefully, if I love doing this uh, LP, I'm going to do another RPG after this one. Works at the Pokemon Mart. Alright, so I guess now we're gonna get introduced to shopping here. Sells Pokeballs and we get a potion from that. It's like, yeah, I know we get a potion somewhere. Alright, so you can go in there and buy something, I guess, if you want to, but because I'm trying to move this along, I'm going to be uh, doing this. Also, something I need to say is how this LP is going to work, too. If there's some days I just don't upload, it's because I'm still grinding, because I am going to be. Leveling up my Pokemon as I go, because uh, something that you guys should know about me, and I've stated it millions of times already, is that if there's one thing I love doing in RPGs is being overpowered. Well, Pokemon is kind of the exception to that, because some, like during some of the final bosses of the game, you can't really be more leveled up than they are at that point, and usually I have to just spend a lot of my time grinding, and that's going to be the part of the game where I'm going to have to take this with me everywhere I go. Alright, so... Let's see, May's right up there, and she, uh, also I need to say this now, is that uh, since I picked Torchic, she's going to pick, um, Mar- uh, I almost said the <laughs> fall form of Mudkip, uh, Mudkip, because that's something your rivals always do, is they pick the opposite of your, uh, of, like, your fire type, you'll, they'll pick a water type, if you pick a grass type, they'll pick Torchic, and stuff like that. Alright, so... I'm starting to notice that I'm starting to take a little bit of damage, so maybe this is a good time for me to go back to the Pokemon Center. Also, I gotta say this now, is that the graphical leap between Pokemon uh, Gold and this one is just staggering. When I saw this game for the first time, I was like, holy crap, this stuff looks so good. I don't know why I said it like that, like, good. Oh well. It's Pokemon Center, if you come here with your Pokemon, you can get them healed for free. And so that's that. Alright, so now I'm just going to go ahead and uh, go back up there. No real use in me cutting yet, because really I'm still trying to just get back in the old flow of things, because I haven't played this game in a few good months. And also, I don't have this game completely memorized, and I'm not going to be showing everything off, like all the legendaries and stuff. Alright, so let's see. The Pokemon found on Route 113. It, <laughs> Route 113, this is 103. Let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what a trainer is all about. I forgot. I forgot how really how good some of this music is. Go north, my fire chicken. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna. Use, I'm just gonna be offensive because that's something about me that separates me from a lot of different trainers that you can see on YouTube or just competitive battling is that 
I'm more of, I'm gonna hammer everything at you, like, I'm gonna use my most uh, offensive moves on you just to kill you, and I'm glad that I'm getting this battle uh, as quick as I am, and, oh, critical, that's sweet. And that should get us a level up, too. Yay, we're at level 7, that's actually where I want to be at. Okay, focus energy, okay, I thought it was level 8, we learned our next move. You're pretty good. 